For Melinda Hughes and her dog Moses, it's a day of grooming and puppy love at the 144th Westminster Dog Show. Because his coat is so big, it takes me three hours to dry him when I bathe him. So it's an ordeal. <laughs> they travel to New York from Oklahoma with their eyes set on the top award, best in show. This is a bucket list item for me. I've been doing this for 34 years, and this is something I've always wanted to do. Good girl, Kira. Handlers are spending the day buffing, brushing, blowing, taking extra steps to flat iron and wrapping dozens of rubber bands, primping these prizes to perfection, making for some very pooped pooches. Who spent more time getting ready this morning, you or Brooklyn? The dog. This is the second day of the three day show. 2,600 dogs from 49 states and 19 countries will put their skills and looks to the test. New this year, the Ozawak joins the competition, bringing the total number of breeds to 204. For some, this show is a family affair. Venus, a bomb detection dog, is hard at work, keeping everyone at the show safe. Last year, her mom won best in breed at Westminster, and this year her sister is competing. It's nice that she's protecting them as well as everybody else. It's what she does, it's what she enjoys, and she's very good at what she does. Westminster is the second oldest sporting event in the country. Only the Kentucky Derby is older. As they say, every dog has its day, but only one can be the top dog Tuesday night when the best of show trophy is awarded. Hillary Lane, CBS News, New York.